This is a bit of a trailer for an um, upcoming series of videos that I'm going to be doing on these little buggers. These are your typical fake, nasty Chinese knockoff um, Apple um, esque, um, basically a little supposedly one ampere 5 volt switching supply designed for charging uh, Crapple products and supplying you know five volts at up to one ampere inclusive through something that uses USB of course these Chinese nasty knockoff ones in addition to being somewhat dangerous can't do that they tend to well horrible regulation and ripple and they tend to go to crap at even a reasonable proportion of their rated load and um, yeah of course all the usuals Designed by Happy in Trowel. Obviously, that isn't a state or country or administrative region of a country or province or ward or whatever you want to call it in any country on Earth. Model number A1265 made in China, blah, 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 as usual. And serial number, long bunch of guff. And the second one. Serial number, identical long bunch of guff, except this one because of the crappy printing, it's kind of worn off on the last six. So yeah, the reason I got two of these is because, I mean, yes, I'm going to load test both of them. Uh, one I'm going to chop open just to see what's inside it, because both of them ain't big, ain't clever, and EEV blog have done teardowns of these things, but they're both, use it, but they're both in 240 volt mains land, and they were sold to... 240 volt mains line with the intention of being used in 240 volt mains line. I'm in 120 volt mains line, so just out of curiosity and whatnot, um, want to see what's inside one of these things that's specifically marketed here in 120 volt mains line because I got them in a retail store about 10 hours ago because I'm filming this at 3:21 a.m. because I just got home. But uh, yeah, so. Yeah, and for as a as a point of reference, this is a genuine uh, crapple charger, as in it came with my uh, iPhone. Before you say anything, it was a birthday slash graduation present from a relative. I would not pay for it, and I have not paid for any crapple device that I own. Don't kill me. Hitmen are expensive, but um, I don't have any robot ninjas yet. But um, yeah, so so yeah, you can see the complete difference. I mean, yes, it is. Uh, well, this is model number one, or A1385. Those are A1265. Um, what are the differences? Uh, focus, you. Um. I'm a, no, don't focus on the ridges on my thumb. Uh, anyways, the um, UL file numbers are different from these, so these are I haven't researched these yet, but those could be easily the um, the uh, underwriters laboratories files for completely different product products that so they aren't just ripping off the legit Apple device. But yeah, you can see various approval marks and uh, stuff that you don't see. Um, these nasty things are Jet, Happy China, which you would not see. Um, of course, the infor information, the two parts of the word being on different lines. Uh, yeah, but then again. And of course, um, one of the things that I want to do is test, because these are marketed as being 100 volt to 240 volt, yet they were sold in a 100, in 120 volt mains land, I want to see what they'll do on 240 volts, which is one reason why I got two, because that way, that the one, even though one of them blows up, which I would expect it to do, um, I still have another one to rip the pieces without it being charred nasty. But yeah. 
Yeah, I can also see the differences in the um, color of the ends there. And also the, um, you can see how the legit Apple one USB thing is centered. This one, it's cockeyed and there's also these little marks which, because these things are sold in kind of a plastic tub thing that you'd expect things like gumballs and, you know, generic, you know, dime store candy to be sold in. But, yeah. It's so random scuffing, but... So make an interesting experiment.